right, so right now we're looking at uh, Santa Barbara Island. We're uh, uh, 2,000 feet above the ground here, the highest portion of the, uh, the actual island. Bring me out a little left, Louis. Uh, we're going to take a good look at the Santa Barbara Island. Uh, it's a beautiful day in December. Uh, there's really not much going on out here. We just uh, contacted uh, Pleed Control. Uh, we're monitoring uh, Pleed Control right now. It's going to be the, uh, the area that uh, controls the airspace over here. But Santa Barbara Island is very unique to this area. It's uh, the island that is the smallest of all. Uh, it's about 20 miles west of Catalina. And uh, bring me over here to the west, Lee. Uh, just like, nice and shallow. Nice and shallow. Uh, yeah. So it's about uh, oh, a good solid uh, 20 miles uh, uh, west of Catalina, and it's uh, pretty far away from all the other islands. Uh, it's interesting though to see. Look at all that white choppy water down there. I mean, that is that is something. That is a heck of a lot of. Uh, Actually, right there, all that white choppy water is, that's a heck of a lot of waves. I don't even know what that is. It's just like a turbulent tunnel of something, underground canyon, or who knows what. Pull it up a little bit, Lee. There you go, there you go. You're good, you're good. I'm going by the GPS, my bad. It's a beautiful morning in December. We're taking a look at the rear side of the island, or I guess front side, depending on how you're looking at it. Uh, it's just a very interesting, beautiful place here. Uh, it's very rare for people to come out here and fly this far out. Uh, you know, some of the things to consider is, number one, you can't really go that low. Um, a little less. Uh, can't really go that low in this area uh, because of the... Channel Islands National Monument, you have to stay 2,000 feet above, and then there's the, uh, uh, gosh, the uh, other National Park regulation that makes you stay at a, another 1,000 feet above uh, ground level when you're close up, so, yeah, we're getting as good as we can for right now. Uh, there's all kinds of unique wildlife on these islands. There's, uh, there's a very specific, uh, unique breeds of uh, anything from birds to other land mammals and uh, things that are, are just so unique to this area that uh, you can't find anywhere in the world. So I guess they kind of say the Channel Islands is like the Galapagos of, uh, of the Pacific Coast, but uh, some people say the Galapagos is the Channel Islands, so uh, we'll take a look at that. I mean, just look at those waves crashing up against the shore there. It's, it's something you don't really see every day uh, anywhere along the, the coast of California. Uh, the water here is also very, very uniquely blue. Uh, very, very clear. Uh, yeah, it's this very unique type of uh, a situation. This is not the island of the Blue Dolphins. The island of the Blue Dolphins is actually going to be uh, uh, San Nicolas Island, and that's going to be where the, uh, the Navy base is. But uh, Santa Barbara Island, I'm not really sure what it's so famous for or what it's well known for. But it's definitely the most isolated, very unique island that doesn't really have anything else with it. Uh, it's kind of just there by itself. There's, uh, you can take a look. There's not very much uh, shrubs or trees or anything like that on the on the actual island. So it's just there on its own. It's a standalone place. So we'll get you some good footage here, and uh, hopefully you enjoy it. And uh, and that's that's basically it. So we'll take a couple loops around and uh, show you guys what we see. Uh, there's really no activity out here. I mean, nobody really comes out this far in their planes or boats. Uh, I'm sure maybe you get the occasional fisherman coming out this way, but uh, you know, we're not we're not really fishermen. We're not really into anything like that. We're just here, just to kind of just show people, uh, you know, hey, this is what these islands have on them. This is what they look like. Uh, you really don't have a lot of pictures or videos of these islands. Uh, and, uh, hopefully one day we'll be able to kind of maybe go and land at one of these islands somewhere uh, along the line. But uh, very beautiful footage we got here. You want to show Catalina up ahead? Catalina is way off in the distance. Those mountains. 
There's a little mountain there, that's Catalina. And uh, going off to the other side, it's going to be uh, back at the land for, for all of us. There's home. Uh, we're still not like 60 miles offshore. We have our flotation devices with us. And uh, we're ready in case of anything. Give me a one more good loop around here, Louie. Yeah, uh, I'm we'll trying work. to stay as far away so I can get you a better look. So let me go just about half a mile further. Okay. Because I want you to get the white wash again real nice.